Hello, YouTubers. It's me, the poet pleasure. One day I'm going to Sunday sermon. You only free time, free time, free. Ta -ha! KC Chess Champion marks the. Dust the horns, baby. And here we are. It's Friday. Early evening, late afternoon, whatever you want to call it. Five something PM. And um, my hob's a little bit dirty there. No, we're doing this kind of Um, yeah, so I've just finished work. And yeah, I'm getting that old bony. That old bony is really getting old now, guys. It's getting old, guys. Uh, you know, it's Friday. As I said, should be going out, should be drinking, should be clubbing, should be rocking, should be rolling. And instead, I'm at this mocker pot. You can see the heat going, you can see the heat going. Got it on slow, I'm gonna brew a coffee because I'm feeling fucking tired. Jesus, I was pretty quiet down at work today as well, so I don't know why I'm this tired. It's because I'm old. Jeez, so. Thought I'd do a little video for you guys. It's been a little while, a little while since the last video. I was gonna open this order, this another card order, because I know you guys like that. Well, I know at least one person in the world likes it, so. Aim to please my bone of and bone lights, but uh, we're all male, mate. I don't know if anyone else in the UK watches these, has had issues with raw mail. It's been very sporadic with their deliveries. So, uh, you know, so I've got an order over a week ago from that Madger's Marketplace to get some Digimon cards for the, the Royal Knights deck. So I was going to do a little opening of that, but uh, that still hasn't fucking arrived yet, mate. Over a week, jeez. And the guys are their cheek. The cheek of the people from Madger's Market have an automated trust pilot email. That wants you to leave a re re review based on your order. I haven't fucking received it yet. But to be fair, Lee Madwick. Madwick, I guess is the person who owns the website. Madwick's Market, Madwick. Clever, like it, like it. Uh, he did reply quite quickly. I mean, going, I haven't even received it, mate. <laughs> it was like, oh, the tracking says it's still, still with raw mail. So I spent 180 quid, right? No cap, guys. Other websites, you order like, you spend 100 quid. Or over 100 quid. They'll give you free... Next day delivery or free 48 day deliver 48 day 48 fucking hour two day delivery 48 hour delivery. This place now nah, just gives you that the crap track. It's not even the good track that gives you updates of, of its journey. It's just it's signed for, but there's like a tracking number for it anyway. Whoa, whoa. Did you hear that sizz? Where's it coming from? This mocker pot business, mate. Let me tell you. Uh, scissors. Is it from the bed? Oh, I don't fucking don't know. I don't know. I'm waiting. I'm waiting, man. I've got it on low. I was waiting for it to start popping up. But, oh, sizzling again. <laughs> oh, oh, there you go. There you go. Got some camera angle here. There you go. That's the culprit. Doesn't matter how tight I make this. It, it fucking still escapes anyway. Obviously, the water is not meant to escape through uh, that bit. It's meant to... Um, it's obviously... There's water at the base, spoils it. In the middle, there's like a cup thing where you put the coffee, and then the water's meant to boil, and then it's meant to mix with the sort of coffee, and then it's meant to, you know, push up through this little hole here, condenses, you know, pushes through, squeezes a lot of pressure, fills this up, and then you uh, set that down, pour it, coffee in it. But, uh,. Miss Tom, this motherfucker, didn't I? Jesus. So this is my Friday evening, mate. I'm, I'm hit with the kids. And I'm uh, waiting for a fucking coffee to brew. I don't know if this is the best technique. In the mornings, when I do this in the morning, I, I do put this on full tilt, yeah? This goes on full tilt. So this will be like, like that. And then when it starts coming through, I'll then turn it down. Uh, I will watch this weird coffee man. Don't, don't, don't boil it too hard. You burn the coffee or some bullshit like that. Oh, I don't fucking know. Um, you know, I'm quarter Sicilian, quarter Sicilian, which is uh, an Italian island. Uh, but no, I don't have like innate DNA experience that says I know how to do the mock pot. Obviously, we've got the Beretti man. Uh, he's having a great time, mate. He loves it. He's got a moustache. He's got a finger up. We the ones. We the ones. The beer already, man. Made in Italy. Still. Still not coming up, mate. Still not coming up. There's some, obviously some stuff in the lid. Obviously, I've had this for a little while. We've had this for the wife's idea. So it was Mrs. Bone Duster's idea. 
Um, but yeah, she watched the creepy coffee man on YouTube. And she liked the idea of it. So no, it's, it's, it's alright, it's alright. It just takes, you know, you can rush it, but... I mean, I don't really like the taste of coffee. I have to put sugar in mine. So I could have rushed it, but... I thought I'd, you know, take a bit of time. Make this an activity. Make this a Friday evening activity. For the bone duster. And it's not very clean hob. Well, you know, it could, it could be dirtier, couldn't it? I suppose it's, you know... I, I, I think this makes it look dirtier than it does in real life. Just how the light shines on it, but... Oh, well, life's not perfect. Neither is the bone duster. But he's going to have his mock pot coffee. It's Friday evening treat. So I didn't have a mock pot coffee this morning because our wife misses... Oh, there we go. There we go. See that? Here we are. It's brewing. It's brewing. It's coming through. Beautiful thing, isn't it? Beautiful thing. Beautiful. Beautiful coffee. Obviously, I have a bit of milk, Mum. A bit of milk, Mum. We've got velvetizer for that. I might show you that. <laughs> I'm not going to show you that as well. We'll just sort of stick with the. We've got a velvetizer from Hotel Chocolat, which we use to froth up milk. Uh, makes the milk a bit warmer. So you're not mixing cold milk with hot coffee straight up, straight up. So that's going there. But yeah, uh, this morning, um, I, I didn't clean this from yesterday. And uh, Mrs. Bone just struggles to open it. So it, that's the point. So I do that quite tightly. So I don't know why water leaks. I do it so tightly, Mrs. Bone just can't open it up. Uh, so she had to use the kettle and like instant because we've got instant coffee as well sometimes this is too fucking faffy you just want to boil a kettle put some hot water in put some milk in bish bash bosh you're sorted sometimes this is a bit faffy but there we go oh yeah beautiful 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 brewing of the mocha pot there you see look, it makes it a bit frothy as well but I've got a bit of milk mine I'm going to have a bit of milk mine so this is a this is all throwing through I don't know if the noise is picking up. Let's get ready because it's going to start. You have to close it when it starts getting a bit, getting a bit too excited. Oh, whoop, whoop, whoop. There you go. I was getting a bit excited there. So that's that. That's our kitchen. That's M for uh, Marcus. Whoop, bit of sugar. This is a velvetizer. See, it's got milk in it. That I've already prepared because... Uh, and then you press this button here. It's meant to be making hot chocolates from Hotel Chocolate. Oh, it's plugged off. It's not plugged in. Wait, it's plugged in. The, the switch is not. Then it goes. See? It's going a bit. There you go. Hotel Chocolate. Yeah, yeah. yeah this is just um, hard water area, isn't it? That's just a bit of hard water. I mean, I don't, I'm not licking the side of that, so it doesn't fucking matter. The inside's clean. Sort of out, so that's gone. When it froths up the coffee, mate. There you go. Wee, wee. There you go. That's coffee there. That's all coffee. That's it. It's normally for me and Mrs. Uh, Baron Duster, but she's coming home from work. She works in an office. I work from home, which is why I'm here. She's not here. Woo. Woo. So we'll just wait for that. Some ASMR shit there. Some text there. Velvetizer. Don't have that. Wasn't particularly clear, but it'll do. Do. Got this for wife for, as a Christmas present, I think it was. Christmas or birthday, but I think it was Christmas. I think it was Christmas. Let's wait for that. Froth up the coffee. Put it in the mug. Sorted, mate. Sorted. Also, this mocha pot, when I when I pour it, when I pour it, there's not enough room for uh, that saucepan in there, by the way. Uh, when I pour it, um, it's going to spill a little bit because it uh, does that. <laughs> I don't think uh, Moretti or the Moretti man, Burametti, Burametti's a beer, but it's, it looks like Burametti, doesn't it? I don't know. Uh, yeah, Barletti. I don't fucking know how to pronounce that. I'm not Italian. I'm only quarter Italian. I didn't get the pronunciation part. I got the love of pasta part. So you go, frothy milk. Wee, wee. So, put the milk in. It's going to be too much milk for this, isn't it? Fucking hell. Milk. There you go. 
Now what I'd normally do, but I've only got one hand, so I won't show it for the video. Put a bit of water in there, a bit of washing up liquid, run it again. That's your frothy milk. Then your mock pot. You can grab it by the handle. Don't grab it on the metal, it'll be really fucking hot, don't be a retail. Oh god, and then we're gonna pour that and you'll see it start spilling from the back. Oh no, it's not it's holding up, it's holding up, it's holding up. Jeez. You can make some patterns if you want, but there you go, that'll do that again. There's a little bit left in there. I might top it up. Top it up if I get a bit halfway through. We don't even spill! No! I ruined it. Oh, my wife's calling me. I think she ruined my video. Press the call. We back? Okay, so I've got to go now and probably actually answer my wife's call, but that was me making a coffee, so I'll call the wife back. Cheers, bye-bye for now.